Hi everybody, I was going to show you how to make today a fruit kvass. You know, in Russia they usually make a beet kvass with beets. But it also works with fruit, especially if you're trying to get little ones to eat it. Fruit usually goes down easier. So, um, what you're going to need is a jar, like a quart sized jar is good. And whatever fruit of choice you like, I have apple, on some ginger, and a cinnamon. And you're going to need a quarter cup of whey. Okay, so what we need to do is fill up the bottom of our jar about a quarter of the way with some fruits, whatever fruit that you like. You could add raisins to this, make it like a apple pie flavor, or you can make a mango or whatever flavors you like. This is what I had available, so if you had some extra fruit that you're just trying to get rid of, this is a great way of doing it and really nice in the summertime we need some extra um, drinks to go around okay so just put your fruit in the bottom of the jar like that you need about a quarter of the jar filled up I added my cinnamon stick in there and we need to uh, shred up about an inch of ginger and add that. Okay, we add our ginger in there. You can add other spices if you want. Whatever flavor you want to make, have fun with it. And put your quarter cup of whey in there. And then you fill up the jar with some water. And you want to add a tablespoon of honey. Okay, and just mix that up. It looks yummy already. Now what you want to do after this is mixed up is you're just going to cover it tightly and leave it out for two to seven days on the counter. And you want to make sure you open it about once a day because the uh, pressure will build up in there. So once a day, just come over to it and take the lid off and put it back on. And that's it. So two to seven days, depending on how warm it is in your environment. And just smell it. It'll smell perfect. And when the fruits look, you know, like they're done being cooked, it's done. <laughs> so that's it. Your kids should love this. So why don't you try it on them? Everyone should love it. It's really loaded with a lot of probiotics and more beneficial enzymes for you. And as the fruit uh, breaks down, it makes a more vitamins in some cases depending on what kind of fruits and or vegetables that you use. Um, if you use it with beets it also provides a lot of, of nutrition for your body. So depending on how nutritious and fun you want to get with this, we'll have extra vitamins no matter what. Mmm it looks delicious already so go ahead and give this a try and let me know what you think about it. Leave a comment below.